Atrioventricular nodal reentry tachycardia, also called AVNRT, is a relatively common type of supraventricular tachycardia. Symptoms of AVNRT include sudden onset fast heart rate, sometimes shortness of breath or dizziness, and infrequently fainting. Occasionally, patients with AVNRT also describe a sensation of pulsations within their neck. To give you an idea of the mechanism behind AVNRT, let me show you this at blaufus.org animation. As you can see, during a normal beat, the electricity starts at the sinus node. The electricity then passes through the two top chambers of the heart, the atria, down to the normal conduction tissue, the normal bridge between the top and the bottom chambers called the AV node. After the electricity heads to the two bottom chambers of the heart, the ventricle, the heart squeezes. In atrioventricular nodal reentry tachycardia, there happen to be two pathways entering the AV node. And in some cases, a normal signal can come, pass through one pathway to the AV node, and then go back up the other pathway, as you can see here. Now you can see the electricity that went back up the abnormal pathway to the atrium, then looped around again, and started its circuit around the AV node. This circuit of electricity is atrioventricular nodal reentry tachycardia and can cause heart rates 200 beats a minute or more. Of note in this type of arrhythmia is the close proximity of the abnormal pathway to the normal conduction tissue, the AV node. It's because of this at the University of Iowa Children's Hospital that we generally choose cryotherapy which is a type of therapy used to get rid of that pathway, which has some reversibility and is considered safer for the treatment of AVNRT.